Alrighty, Lumberjacks, welcome back to another single-player episode. As promised uh, from the last one, I think what we're going to do is we're going to jump in this guy. We'll take her to the mill uh, just to get out of here. I think what I'm going to do with loads on this one is I'm going to actually um, park them and save up the wood as opposed to putting it all in the mill. I think that's the plan. I think that's what I'm going to do. So we'll try it, see what happens. Now I just gotta figure out a place that we wanna park the stuff in, and then we'll be getting. <laughs> Alright, so let's find a place. Maybe we'll use these sheds here. There's a lot of these. This would actually be a good place to probably start compiling our wood here. Let's start at this end. I have a feeling we're probably gonna have a few of these loads, so. We'll just see how good we can back it in here. We can unlock the load so we can jam it right against the wall. Does that look good? Oops. Let's lock it and unlock it. Nice. Big pile of nasty wood. I like it. Okay, so let's buy ourselves another trailer. There we go. Buy another one of those, hook it up, head back out, and then uh, I think what we'll do is we'll kind of start nitpicking into that new block, and we're going to find out what that processor was cutting at, because I don't think we were cutting at five meters, those don't look like fives. And if they are five, I think maybe we'll downgrade to fours, because um, it's hard to fit all that on the trailer like that. So we'll see how it goes. Let's get this bad boy up there and turned around first, and then we'll sort it out. I'm thinking what I should do is I might make a cleanup load here and I'll show you what I'll do so maybe we'll do a little bit of loading first so we'll finish off loading I'm going to because if we do change obviously I'm gonna change whatever size we have but we still have a lot on the ground um, next to that Paluta that are all uh, like that current meter length and I don't want to mix match the, the wood types because it'll just be really annoying so what I'm going to do instead, I wonder if I can just turn around right here. It's kind of a sharp turn. Ninety degrees, go! Oh, well, that's not bad. I just got to straighten her out. So this time what I want to do, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to make a cleanup load. So I'm going to build a little bit of the front, a little bit of the back, and then I'm going to take all that crap pile over there and pile it in the middle. It'll be kind of an ugly load, but okay. Alright, let's get this on the front. Oops. Nice big grab for the front. There we go. Uh, how close to our thingies are? We're pretty much right in them, hey? Oh, man. Here, I'm gonna just change my position here. Sorry, bud. There we go. Might be a little tippy without my stabilizers down, but we'll try. I'm going to shuffle this over here, and then I'm going to shuffle these over there, oops, good lord, okay, I'm going to raise my bucket up, uh, drop these guys down, Oh, weird. Oops. Oh, they kind of popped into the ground a little bit there, huh? <laughs> what the heck? Hey, whatever. You know what? We're in the ground. That's good. 
So let's get all of these. I'm gonna put these on the front. It'd be a really ugly cleanup load, but I'm gonna get creative here. That's the way I'm looking at it. Oops. Just those two, right? Maybe we should be using this view just for fun. Oh, oh no! Oh, stay. They will stay. Or I command them to do so, please. Okay. Uh, just on the edge. There we go, beauty. I command them to do so, but I still have to say please. Okay, so now, uh, let's raise these up. Oops, woo -hoo, careful. Uh, I don't think I need to, uh, I don't need to put them down for this. The heck with it. I'm just going to throw it on here. Okay, now I want these forward more if I can. It's not like we're unloading these trailers there. Just getting parked anyway, so it's no big deal. And beautiful. Throw that in here. That looks alright. Yeah, nice, good flat spot. Okay, now we got all this ugly stuff over here. So now we're just gonna kinda do whatever with it. Some of it's long, some of it's short. It's going to be this really bad spliced mess. Oh no, that's not what I wanted to happen. Oh my. Oh my lord. This one's not going where I wanted it to go, so let's just see if we can fight it. Oh man, that was a poor decision. I should have separated the little guys. Didn't think of that. <laughs> Might be able to save some of it. It'll be just like a weird, spicy, messy load. Ah, I should have got those tops. I'm gonna have to pinch it. Pull it out the top. It's the only way I can do it. Oh, that's good. That's what I wanted to do. This is why when you clean up a load, you uh, I should have put flat in the middle, too, instead of leaving it bunked. I don't know what I was thinking. There we go. Whatever. That'll hold. Okay, what do we got left? <laughs> this is this a bad load. Drag some of it out. Let's see what we got here. So we got a couple of short pieces and a long piece. So let's grab that little piece there, drag it over. Grab these two first. I don't care about that little bit. That's okay. Yeah. These little pieces can just slip in here. Oops. Then these long bits can go right across top. There's more weight down here, so let's grab it about uh, right about there. And we'll just kind of hide them in the middle, I guess. We'll call it the nasty load, because it's a nasty load.
That's a swamp login load right there. Just trash. Trash wood. I don't want to get that little one down there. I don't know if I'm able to get it. Oops. Put it back in. Coax it in here. I can't get it. <laughs> Whatever, man. Whatever. Okay, we'll leave this here. Actually, no, we won't leave it here. We're going to back it up. And we're going to park it right on this corner again. Right about here. Drop these. Put that right about just here somewhere, sure. And that one's just irritating me, so I'm gonna see if I can get out of there. We'll hand bomb this one off. And then if I drop it, grab it, we can steroid chuck it up here. Whee! Oh yeah, there you go. Not really, but whatever. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna call that a load because I just wanted out of here. That was the that was a hideous load. My bad. Whatevs. Yeah, I'm gonna drop this one off the mill, and then uh, we should be good for this video. I think. That was a really long video just to do that load. Hey, so much faster when everything just is nice and conformed. Just because I want to get rid of this. But the best way you could do would be like take all that garbage that we just had, like all those little crap bits build a cradle like we were doing in some of the other episodes and then splice it in. It's a little bit easier with like a button top or fixed head. Angles are a little tricky to do splicing. Don't have as much control. We still do it, it's just a lot more work and time and time and effort, right? Time and effort. Get a little closer to that one. Oops. My first day with my new legs. Unlock it, back it right in there. Oops. Let's uh, try that. Oops, let's uh, lock it first. There we go. Beauty! Oh, look, our helicopter's floating up there. Probably sits on top of the tower and you can see the helicopter. I made the uh, helicopters visible for a long way so you can see them flying, but that's why it looks like it's floating. It's kind of funny. Okay, so I'll just park this guy here. Um, Yeah, I guess we'll call that a video for now. Uh, next time when we come back, uh, I guess we'll just kind of keep uh, chopping away on that trail. Maybe get into that new block. Eat up that. Definitely change the size of the wood for sure. See how it goes. But yeah, uh, thanks for watching. If you guys enjoyed it, hit that like button. Leave a comment. And uh, yeah, subscribe to FDR Logging. We love you. Join us. <laughs> All right, guys. We'll catch you on the next one. See ya.